Farm Guy here, and this is the Lizard 8560 by R. Mikhail on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl for this test. This is 27.38 megabytes to download, 13 slots on console. It is a trailer, and we'll find it under trailers, but it is several different configurations as a trailer. Here we go, up to 23,100 liters. Um, but that has a uh, caveat on it, as in something you should know about that particular one. We have bale trailer, grain body, loader, grain body again, body for silage, and bale trailer. We didn't, I didn't take a bale trailer out, but I'll buy this one. Wheels. So we get star, star two. Euro disc, Euro disc two, Euro disc three, and back to star. So that's it for tire tra uh, choices. It doesn't bother me that we only have those. Um, it doesn't really matter. Design color. You can pick blue, orange, green, khaki. Ooh, khaki two, and gray. I like khaki part two, even though it wasn't as good as part one. Uh, design color. Well, that's uh, let's make it orange, and that actually is this the uh, body for silage, the top part. So that's your design color option. But we want bale trailer because we didn't buy one yet, um, and because well, for the reasons of it's a bale trailer, so you put stuff in there and you lock it down with the straps and that's about it right so let's hop into our tractor here <clears throat> i have uh the base model one here filled with rocks 15,400 liters uh yes i i, I didn't point out the liters, did I? Bale trailer, of course. So they got the drain body at 15,400. Extended grain at 23,100. Uh, silage is 23,100. And yeah, okay. So the extension, grain body extension and the silage both carry the same amount. Uh, my apologies. Um, lights, signals, right. Pretty much otherwise standard, except for this little feature here, L1 and X. Watch what happens when I press L1 and X. Oh my, what's that? That locks that front axle. Now it's hard to, uh, that, well, near impossible to turn with it like that. However, Backing up now is, if you want to back up straight, that's the cat's meow. Um, and you can always go L1 and X again and let it loose. So no more squirreling around trying to, although it's not too bad backing it, but you get the idea. Now, um, what have what would have been a most awesome feature ever uh, has turned it a bit sour because none of these trailers have hitches on them so you can't string them together oh my goodness why would you do that oh it's been a long day pardon my exasperation but we have tip side left or right tip side right looks like this and as a matter of fact they all tip like that pretty much uh, except one of them which we will show in a moment <clears throat> so if we uh, run along over here um, yes the uh, extended version works just fine tips exactly the same no difference there the one with the silage in it yeah nothing different where there with the silage the bale trailer is a bale trailer now this is something somewhat interesting it has an auger wagon 
attachment on it. And what's interesting about this, <clears throat> aside from the auger wagon feature, is it only holds auger wagon type products. So you can't put stones in here, fertilizer and seed and, and um, crop is what goes in here, not potato either, um, grain crops. So R1 and right stick left and right, we can move that up and down. Now, even in this position, over top of cell point or wherever, it will not unload. Why is that? Well, because L1 and down uh, you need to do that. That is pipe out. Now you got to give it a minute because it does this. It tips and then the auger turns on. Now R1 and right stick left and right you can adjust that auger like so to wherever you need to put it but that's about it. If you want to stop it L1 and down pipe in and it will immediately stop and f uh, and go down. You will have to R1 and right stick place that auger back down for transport. But that's an interesting. I think there was uh, there's been one or two like this um, already, but makes it interesting. It's a little bit more interactive than just automatically unloading and thus like that. And there you have it. That is your Lizard 8560 by R. Mahale on Farming Simulator 22. Thank you all for watching. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.